I was going through the garage earlier on and I come across this. Now you're thinking, what the hell's this? Well, it's a, it's a cover for my knife, fork and spoon. Um, and what it is, it's um, a collar of an old shirt. And what I've done it, is I've cut the, the collar out and there's the point of the collar on the one side. And I've super glued along there where I've cut it and along there where I've cut it to stop it fraying. And um, I'll put a little lace on like that. You could put a little toggle on as well to cinch it if you like. And what I do, because it's double layered, I used it for a, my knife, fork and spoon like that. And I used to just tie it, tie it up. I'm not, I'm not gonna do a, a bow. Oh, go on, I'll do a bow. There you go. And there's your knife, fork and spoon inside its cover. Nice and strong and last for years and years. So, uh, yeah, I thought I'd do a little video on that. Something you could do. So if you've got an old army shirt or an old shirt of some sort and you've bought a new one, an upgraded, better version, and you've got a list of this old army shirt, um, you could cut the collar out like that and uh, use it as your knife, fork and spoon um, cover. It'll last for years. It's good stuff. What I'm using these days is this old uh, handset cover. Only reason being is I use this sort of spatula as well, and it's a bit of a faff getting it in there. I don't think it'll go in really. Um, and also, I've got this as well, so uh, I use this, and it's it's less likely to absorb the moisture because it's sort of a, a plasticky strong sort of thing uh, so that's why I use that for and uh, this is the cutlery I use these days so it goes in there all right I can fit it in there oh by the way this is a life venture titanium spoon and I can put that in there put these in as well I got these in because I don't really use a fork and a knife that much. It's mainly a spoon, isn't it? Get that in there and that, this little stirrer to get the crap off the bottom of the, bottom of the pot and stuff. And again, just sew it up, uh, tie it up. Happy days. So uh, if you've got a, a long sort of spoon like that, and you haven't got a cover, then you could use a collar of an old shirt. As long as it's a good sort of solid shirt or military shirt, something like that. There you go. That's what that is. Thanks for watching and uh, cheers. See you again, hopefully. Oop, windy.